He's not going, going gone. He's gone. Jacoby Ellsbury with the Bronx, with the Bronx Bombers, seven years, $153 million. I'm Kevin DuPont for Globe 10.0 here with Scott Thurston. How much are they going to miss this guy? Yeah, they'll miss him. Yeah. Uh, I, I think significantly. I never would have come close to matching that kind you of money. You and I did the World Series, and we talked about this. You, seven, you, you, yeah. thought, you thought he'd re they, they would really miss him. Yeah. Uh, you know, seven years is ridiculous. I right. think $153 million is ridiculous. Uh, you're going to have to replace the offensive production more than anything. You can turn to Bradley in center field. He can give you what Jacoby gave you defensively. But offensively, there's nobody who can put at the top of the order that he can give you what Ellsbury gave you. Yeah, because he gets on, he gets speed. So sure. the single is the double, the Sets double the is table. the triple. Sets the table. He's constant threat. Causes. So he's a valuable guy. The issue being, and you hit it right off the top here, is he's age 30. Uh, he's got to have his legs. He has had a brittle history. So right. you're investing. You know what it is? This is a five-year, $153 million a year. He's not going to play seven years anywhere near his peak performance. No, and they're on the hook for, you know, what, $30 million at the back end of that contract. So, yeah, it, it, that's a, it's a ridiculous deal for the right. length. Uh, with the Red Sox, Red Sox probably going to give them, what, three, four years? Yeah. $85 million that they were probably going right. to prepare to go to. That's yeah. it, which ends up being $0.50 cents on the dollar. Right. You got no interest in. We are getting used to this drill, though. When you go down the list of former Red Sox we've seen in pinstripes, yeah. somewhat painfully, you know, Roger, Boggs, Uke, uh, Damon, uh, Louis Tiant. I go way back to Sparky Lyle. Sure. So we know the drill. If you look at those five or six guys, this one the hardest? To, the hardest one to stomach? The hardest to digest, probably, yeah. Um, you know, Damon was tough. Uh, Damon was tough. And look what happened to Damon when he came back. And the same thing's going to yeah. happen to Jacoby. Uh, you think so? You yeah. Really, okay. Look, this, this, the Sox have built up some goodwill now with the fans. I don't see right. the outcry uh, among the fan base now with Ellsbury leaving that there was when Damon left. Yeah. So I think ultimately the right move. Well, what makes it go down quite easily, in my, in my opinion, is two words. Carl Crawford. They didn't lock into another $20 million deal for a guy, obviously better than Crawford, but you know what? Numbers are going to diminish.